been a few days, so I thought I'd better do a bit of an update on what's been happening. Um, I managed to get a roof, the roof racks and roof basket on. These roof racks I picked up for five bucks, so they're the real old school style ones. But I just had to make a couple of modifications here to fit them on the rail there and buy one new one of these, which was five bucks. So all up, the roof racks cost me ten bucks and they're in there really solidly so roof basket I already had probably going to put the uh, solar panel on the top of that hopefully I might be able to get a spare tire in between as well so that's that bit and you'll see now the shed is a bit more naked because I took the bed out I've put the bed back in so now we're starting to get there the bed in the back I think looks all right and I put some insulation in the side here and for whatever reason the insulation's pink on the inside but uh, I actually think it really suits actually excuse the shopping bags and umbrellas hanging up but I think that really suits so next step I think is we're going to get a double mattress and see how far it comes over to this side and uh, if I can we'll put it to where it's supposed to go and then I'll build some shelving straight up on the on this side if I can but underneath there's still plenty of room under there as I said I'm not really worried about that for under the under there up the top there I think the um, fridge will cover all that top bit where the floor's poking up this is still this paint that I last lot of paint is horrible it's still tacky after like three days uh, but I'm not going over it again so I can have that shabby chic look or whatever they bloody call it just clamp down with a few of those there's a couple up the front there's one at the front there and there's a couple underneath as well so it's not actually bolted to the floor so the floor isn't marked as such and yeah i had a bit of a boo-boo here these stupid things when they're pushed in everything else drilled out fine and able to put a self tapper in there but this one no i had to get the welder out and weld up the hole and then self tap it so but got it to work so yeah there's that uh i think the next step's going to be maybe tomorrow um that front bit i'm going to put another covering in but i'm going to make it bigger so that i can uh, use it as a storage part so i'll make like a, a hinge and and so forth with that as well so that I can open that and store the gas canisters and, and that sort of stuff in there make use of any room I can so yes yeah, this is where I'm at at the moment and yeah I think it's I'm quite happy with how it's coming along to be honest I think the wood floor and the white for the bed even though it's that this horrible fucking flavor I think it's coming along quite well Alright, well, until next time, have a good weekend.